Normal pupillary light reflex. Pupillary constriction occurs as a reflex in response to stimulation of the retina by light. Afferent fibers from the retina travel along each optic nerve to the optic chiasm, where they split and follow both optic tracts to reach the pretectal areas in the midbrain. Nuclei within the pretectal areas activate both of the Edinger-Westfall nuclei, each of which sends parasympathetic fibers down the ipsilateral oculomotor nerve to the ipsilateral pupillary constrictor muscle. Due to the crossovers in this pathway, light entering one eye causes both direct pupillary constriction in the ipsilateral eye and consensual pupillary constriction in the contralateral eye. Afferent pupillary defect is caused by a lesion in the retina or optic nerve. When light enters the affected eye, Interruption of afferent fibers prevents both direct and consensual pupillary constriction. When light enters the unaffected eye, both pupils constrict normally. When the light is moved back to the affected eye, the pupils in both eyes dilate as they return to their natural state in a dark room.